Hey, how's it going, everyone? It's time once again to find some more goofs in Thomas and Friends. Today's episode is Terrence the Tractor. I hope you enjoy it. Alright, so at the beginning of this episode, we see Thomas puffing down his branch line. And in the field, we can see Terrence the Tractor hard at work. Thomas wants to- Wait a minute. In the last scene, Thomas was pulling Annie and Clarabelle, but in the next scene, they're gone. And then a few seconds later, they're back. Thomas has never seen Terrence the Tractor before, so he decides to stop and talk with him. Hello, said the Tractor. I'm Terrence. I'm plowing. Thomas then introduces himself, and he tells Terrence he has ugly wheels. What ugly wheels you've got? <laughs> They're not ugly. Terrence explains to Thomas that they aren't wheels, they're caterpillars. That means he can go anywhere. I don't need rails. Thomas was really rude to Terrence, and then he puffed slowly away. Time goes by, and winter hits the island of Sodor. But something changed here. Something doesn't look quite the same. Now pay close attention to this hill in the background. As fall transitions to winter, the hill changes in shape. <laughs> now here's a side-by-side -side comparison. As you can see, there's definitely a difference. Thomas's driver is a little worried about the snow. A heavy fall is coming. I hope it doesn't stop us. And here comes another goof. In the next scene, Thomas is sliding on the rails. <coughs> and then right before this scene changes, we can see some studio equipment. <coughs> Eventually, Thomas makes it to the station. But once he comes to a stop, he sees something he doesn't like. A snow plow. And here's another goof. Thomas is missing from the background. <coughs> Thomas's driver tells him that he needs to put on the snowplow. This makes Thomas upset. Snow is silly soft stuff. It won't stop me. The snowplow was heavy, and it was very uncomfortable for Thomas. Out of frustration, Thomas shook and banged his snowplow, and by the end of the day, it was so damaged that they had to take it off. You're a very naughty engine, he said to Thomas. The next morning, Thomas gets ready to pull his train. This is where I spotted another goof. When Thomas goes to couple up to Annie and Clarabelle, we see a troublesome truck on the tracks beside him. But in the very next scene, a brake van is in front of it. <laughs> Thomas's driver and fireman worked hard on the snowplow, but they couldn't make it fit. Thomas is delighted. He couldn't stand wearing a snowplow. I shan't have to wear it. I shan't have to wear it. But this made Annie and Clarabelle nervous. Now in this next scene, look at Annie and Clarabelle. Both of their nameplates are missing. <laughs> Thomas's driver was worried about the snow. It's not bad here, but it's sure to be deep in the valley. There's the edge of the set. <laughs> Thomas wasn't a bit concerned about the snow. Snow can't stop me. Thomas thought he was so clever. He didn't think snow could stop him. But then there was trouble. Thomas runs right into a snowdrift and gets stuck. Cinders and ashes. I'm stuck. Thomas's driver tells him to back up, but his wheels just spin and he can't move. Meanwhile, Annie is smiling. This doesn't make sense. She's supposed to be upset. <laughs> The conductor went to go get some help, and the rest of the passengers try to dig the snow away. Wait a minute, D do you guys see this? This guy looks like Sir Topham Hatt, but he's a little skinnier. Did Sir Topham Hatt go on a diet? I'm Sir Topham Hatt, and I... That's 32 pounds on Nutrisystem. Anyway, the passengers tried to dig the snow away, but it was no use because the snow kept rolling in. Thomas regrets not wearing a snowplow. What a silly engine I am. Fortunately, Bertie the bus comes to pick up the passengers. And then came Terrence the tractor to the rescue. Even though Thomas made fun of Terrence, he still came to help him out. Are you serious right now, Annie? You're smiling when Thomas is stuck in the snow, but then frowning when someone's rescuing you. And since we're on the topic of faces, Terrence always has the same facial expression. There's never a moment where he's not smiling. It's actually kind of creepy. So Terrence couples up to Annie and Clarabelle and pulls them out of the way. But look at this. Annie has switched places with Clarabelle. <laughs> Terrence moves Annie and Clarabelle out of the way. And then he goes to help Thomas. Thomas's wheels were clear, but he was still having trouble getting out. Once Terrence was coupled up, he slowly pulled Thomas out of the snow. Terrence was then uncoupled, and Thomas was able to move on his own. Okay, I have a question. How did all that snow on Thomas vanish so quickly? There's no way it melted that fast, and they certainly didn't shovel it off in that amount of time. This is most definitely a goof. <laughs> Thomas then couples up to Annie and Clarabelle, and he thanks Terrence for saving him from the snow. Oh, thank you, Terrence. Thomas's driver tells him that he needs to be more sensible in the future. I'll try, said Thomas. And this marks the end of the episode. 
Alright guys, so those were all the goofs that I found in Terrence the Tractor. I can't believe I never saw some of those goofs before. Now if you saw a goof that I didn't point out, go ahead and let me know by leaving a comment. Thanks for watching this video guys, have a great day. Go for the